You are probably thinking these are just ordinary tomatoes. But they aren't. These tomatoes have been grown sustainably, with the greatest care and attention. It all starts with the seeds. There are companies that do research into which seeds give which kind of flavor to the tomatoes, or which special properties a seed has to make it more resistant to pests and diseases. The next important aspect contributing towards sustainable growing is the soil. Actually today, a majority of tomatoes are grown on stone wool based growing media instead of soil. This is due to the fact that if you grow in the soil, water and nutrients drain down into the soil and go to waste. By growing on stone wool, all the water and nutrients given are available to the plant. In the airy and light stone wool, the plant has all the space it needs to really put down root. Grodem makes this stone wool from a natural volcanic stone, basalt. Stone wool has a number of advantages. It does not lock up any of the applied liquids, so the grower knows exactly how much water and nutrients he's giving his plants. Plus, the grower can regulate the climate in the greenhouse just the way he wants. Inside the greenhouse, the climate and the irrigation are accurately measured and adjusted where necessary, so that plants always have the perfect conditions to grow in and so that no energy is wasted. The grower can also steer how the plants grow, so that they produce more fruits per square meter. And what's more, the water and nutrients that drain out of the stone wool can easily be collected and reused, because stone wool is a clean growing medium. More can be produced using the fewest possible resources, in such a way that the quality of the tomatoes is improved. We also call this method of cultivation precision growing. So now you may be asking yourself, why is it so important to grow using sustainable methods? The answer is simple, because we have to. The world's population is continuing to grow and our precious resources are slowly but surely being depleted. To give you an example, in 2050, we will need double the amount of food that we need now, but it will have to be produced with half the resources we use now. So we have to be able to do more, using less and in a better way. And a whole lot of sustainable and creative solutions have been devised to answer that problem. Here are just a few examples. Many high-tech greenhouses around the world generate energy as a byproduct of their main activities and then supply the power to the surrounding area. For example, in the Netherlands, about 10% of the national energy generation comes from the greenhouse industry. Nowadays, crop protection products are hardly ever used in greenhouses. Any harmful insects are controlled by releasing predatory mites or predatory wasps into the crops so they can eat all the harmful pests. Bumblebees fly around the greenhouses to pollinate the flowers so that the tomatoes can grow. One cubic meter of basalt is enough to be able to produce no less than 50 cubic meters of stone wool. And on those 50 cubic meters of stone wool, we can grow 350,000 kilograms of tomatoes. Once the cultivation season is over, the stone wool can be recycled. Used stone wool makes a great raw material for the brick making industry. 50 cubic meters of stone wool is enough to produce 8 cubic meters of bricks. And all that thanks to one cubic meter of basalt. All these creative and sustainable solutions have been developed to ensure that plants can grow as well as possible, with the least possible impact on the environment. Grodin, in cooperation with many other organizations and institutes, continuously works together with growers to ensure that vegetables are grown in ever better and more sustainable ways. But more importantly, it's the skill of growers with their forward-looking methods that make sure that not only you, but also your children and your grandchildren can eat simply the most sustainably grown, tasty, safe and healthy vegetables. And Grodin is happy to make its contribution too. Grodin. Sustainable growing for a sustainable future.